We got most of them that we have right now. They came in for GED to finish out their GED testing. And uh, we have one that graduated from high school and he came aboard um, by uh, finding out about the program. VAST uh, stands for Vocational Advancement of South Texas and it's a grant that uh, was given to us by the THECB, the Texas Higher Education Coordinating Board. And uh, it uh, provides um, the students with the funding, you know, the finances to to a better life, you know, if they want to, if they have the desire to to come to college and get an education and go into the working force immediately, ASAP, the VAST grant makes that possible for them. Yeah, I want to be a water for a long time. It's helping me, like, getting more education that I need for the future. Rosie inspires me because they help you and they encourage you to do better. He's a good instructor. He encourages us a lot. He helps us on our wells, like tells us what to do to improve it. In the class, we learn about different kinds of welds and the shop for more hands-on on the welds. I have a big family. Uh, I like playing football, guitar, stuff like that, you know? A bunch of stuff music-wise, I guess. I've been taking classes and stuff, like in other programs, like Upper Bound, and, you know, just uh, the whole graduating thing kind of stopped me. So whenever I can like sign up for my GED, they told me that this program was available. So it was pretty awesome to join and stuff. Yeah, there's there's a lot of money in that. Uh, definitely for for uh, welders right now, there's a big big demand for them. But he's a pretty good instructor, you know. He gets on to us whenever we mess up. He makes us want to do better in class, inspires us, you know, stuff like. And if we're late to class, he gets on us too, you know. Be on time for work whenever we actually get a job, you know. She, she, she's the one that pushes us to, you know, do better. She's always, she's always telling me to, you know, come see me if you need help with anything or you need to talk or stuff like that. Get him signed up for the GED tests. She's been a big help. I mean, the uh, staff is really nice. They have good instructors, good teachers. Well, I really only came to sign up for the actual GED test, and then they uh, informed me that you know this program was available and they had like so many things I could do and I, I told them like I, I liked welding. I have a baby on the way also so it's, it's kind of helped a lot you know I have something to look forward to job wise. I would definitely recommend it I mean they pay for everything so you just have to show up at the class and put in the effort. I've always I was always interested in it but especially because I have my brother like a like alongside me to help me. Well he's a good teacher and you know, he helps us out a lot. He pushes us, you know. He encourages us and, you know, even though we make, mis like, we make mistakes welding, he doesn't tell us in a bad way, you know. He just tells us, you know, like, keep on practicing or, like, he'll tell us um, to, like, practice and practice, get better at it. So he's a real good teacher. Besides being a jokester, <laughs> keep your head up and, you know, don't let anything discourage you. Just keep on going, because soon things will get better. Well, as growing up, I loved uh, running cross country, uh, bowling. I was in the junior uh, bowling league, and you know it was pretty good. You know, I loved you know math and science and whatnot, and you know I just you know went with that. You know, and that's why when I you know first heard about the VAST program. It was very, very interesting. So I said, you know what, sign me up for it. And when I, you know, went to the orientation and everything, and went to the, you know, the class, it was like, you know, it was like, wow, you know. And it gave me an insight of what college life and, you know, what is and you know how it is. And it's just, you know, the program itself. It's, uh, I would highly recommend it to anybody and everybody. During the uh, vast program with uh, welding department uh, I picked up you know how you know certain electrodes and you know 7018s different you know their kind of terminology with the welding department and you know I, let me tell you this it's very very interesting and how you know heat can really so much heat can do something you know the VAST program it like gave me that sense of comfort to where you know I didn't have to worry about buy my supplies, I didn't have to worry about, you know, me doing without because the program actually takes care of you. 
and provides for you and you know supports you to the whole way and you know it gives you that you know sense of that peace of mind to where you can come to school and say hey I got this. Mr. Moreno he's a very easygoing guy and he uh, his uh, motto is weld or go home. If you think that you can't go to college or you know you're thinking of what college life may be go to the VAS program. You know they're like you know very little red tape and a whole you know uh, life-changing experience put it that way. I had very very little confidence and when I called up here, you know, check what they had, and they told me about the VAS program. It gave me hope, hope, and you know, you know, I was excited, excited and nervous, you know, especially the first day. And when I actually started, you know, coming to class and you know, interacting, and you know, it just gave me this whole, you know, different kind of outlook on my confidence and you know the way you know I thought I couldn't learn, but I learned new things about myself that I can. And you know, and it helped me sharpen enough for when I did get my GED, and it boosted my you know confidence like sky high, and you know, I, it was real great. The fearless six plus one. It all started uh, that we had six, and they were so eager to start welding, so I named them the fearless six. And then about a week later, we had another gentleman uh, join in, so we couldn't call him the fearless six anymore. So. We deemed them the Fearless Six Plus One. I'm very proud of the students that they've come a long way. So it's made me very proud and honored to actually help these guys. And, and actually I'm producing many me's of all these students. So it, 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 I'm, I'm truly blessed. When they go out there, they're gonna reflect what I know. And if they go up there and not do as I showed them, then there's something wrong. And so, then that will reflect back to me and it will show that I didn't, as an instructor, I didn't show them what they were supposed to be shown. Because this is their livelihood. They're supposed to be more money than I am. See, and that's, that's what it's all about, is, is creating a person. Uh, and I hope that I make uh, a difference in their lives in that now they're going to make money. Life is hard and tough, but it's tougher if, if you don't educate yourself. Education is the letter of success. It also opens up a lot of doors and it, it helps you see what else is out there, you know, and not just staying at home, uh, saying I can't make it. That's not so. That's not so. If you just try to give yourself a chance, you will succeed. I think it's all of us working together. I think that, you know, CBC plays a big role. You know, I believe that success doesn't involve only one person. It involves a lot of people. A lot of people uh, take part in it. And, um, and I think these students get that through our program and through CBC. Uh, we get a lot of support from everybody else in the departments here. We've had people that uh, have come to look for our program and um, uh, I would like to take the opportunity and mention, you know, a great big thanks to all the other department directors and people, staff of CBC that walk these people over and make sure that they do find us, you know, so that's very important. So therefore, I think it's a lot of teamwork. You know, we're a CBC family here and that's what it takes. It's like we take them and we see them grow. The parents, I think, will be very emotional over seeing their children, you know, put, life, put their lives on track and to succeed in their wishes, you know. Would I do it again? Yes, most definitely.